Okay, I'm going to make a video tutorial on using CentOS 6.3 to be a PDC, primary domain controller. So both Windows and Linux based operating systems can log on to it. Okay, so we are cracking. So I'm going to open it terminal server. Terminal, terminal. I'm logging as root. And what I gotta do, I'm gonna check and see if, if Samba is already installed. Uh, Samba doesn't seem to be installed. So I'm gonna install it quickly. Yeah, I'm gonna install. Yeah, I'm gonna install Samba. Should install quickly. Okay, it's almost installed. Right, so we see the version is 3.5. Right, um, now what I'm going to do, I'm going to edit the SMB config file. Now, I'm going to do a basic configuration, a very basic minimal configuration of of a PDC. Not gonna do any room profiles or anything. I'm just simply going to allow users to log into the domain, okay? So the work group had a change. I'm changing it to CentOS. I can leave I can leave the NetBrowse name. I think I can leave it commented out, but I'm gonna leave it as server. I'm gonna put it in and leave it as server. Okay, so I'm gonna look at the various headings. Right now, I'm in standalone server. I don't want that. I want. I don't want domain members either. I'm just setting domain control options. Right. So security once you set to user or domain controllers. I'm gonna do that. Domain master specify Samba to be only domain master to be the domain master browser. I want that. Domain logons. Let Samba be a domain logon server. I want that as well. And the various logon scripts. I will talk about it a little while, but primarily I'm going to use this. Various scripts can be used on the controller standard on machine to add I'll show you what I mean. Right, so security set to user. I'm using that. Domain master, yes. Domain logons, yes. And machine script. Great. Now what's also important to note is what this is gonna what this is this is very important. What this means is every machine that logs on to the domain would be a part of the workstation group so that I create a group for workstation. Right? Um, what does I have to configure? Um, anything else? No, I think that's it. Yes, that's it. And we can test to see. We can test to see if the config is correct or not. Before you try and join the domain, run the test palm command and success. Role is domain PDC. That's what I want to see. Um, I would also need to add users. User add to something. I want to use the M creative home directory. So I'm gonna use create user Adrian. I'm wanting the new home directory already exists for what happened. I tested it before with Adrian, right? So that's why I get at. Make like someone use another user, forget Adrian. Um, um, who can I put? Coral, user Coral, you know, my phone. So, add user Coral. Um, what else? What else? What else? Password. Um, 
password. I don't have any switches necessary for that. Just password and coral. Add a password. Add a password. And now one last command. SMB. Let's see switches for this. Switch is A. Coral. Yes, yeah, so right. So, user added there. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to make sure certain services are running. That's why password start. SMB is critical and NMB as well. So, got that started. I'm also going to restart it just to make sure I don't want any problems here. Do I have time to do this over? All right, restart. What else do I need to do? Um, let me confirm the IP address 2.102 and then 2.102 and then let me see the result. Alright, um, I think that's it. Let me go on start the XP VM and get cracking. Starting XP. We'll make sure the XP VM could ping um, Recentos domain controller. You see the IP config. Checks. You config 2.102, 2104, ping 2.168.2.101. Ping the domain controller. Let me try and join the domain. Right now the work group is me and the computer is doing XP. So I'm changing that to CentOS. I'm gonna see what's gonna happen. Great. Well, one thing I didn't show was I had already taken the liberty of adding root to a SMB um, as an SMB user. So the root account, the admin account, has the authority to add clients to the domain. So that's what I'm gonna do now. I just didn't show you that command, but it's very similar, not identical to 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 this command. I just instead of putting coral, I put in root, and that was it. All right? So let me check and see what's gonna happen. Right, good join the main. Now let me restart the machine and see if I can log in as Coral. And that should be it. I'll do another video soon after to show that um, a Linux OS can join the domain as well. So Carl is joining the domain, that's good to see. It's pretty noisy background when he was them disgusting me right now. So Coral is the user, as you can see. So I join the domain, and uh, yeah, have a generator drive on the Samba server by default. It's a Z drive. All right. So thanks for watching, and continue watching the rest of the videos. Satisfies the criteria of the assignment. Take care.